A fishing vacation in the Bahamas leaves a Manatee County teenager very ill. He was poisoned by a fish that he caught and then ate. Fox's Kimberly Cuisan reports it is a rare case, but something this family says others need to know about. There's one place you can usually find Austin Goncalves. Every chance he gets, he's on the water as, I mean, he's been fishing since he could hold a fishing pole. So a trip to the Bahamas with his mom, her boyfriend, and a friend seemed perfect until halfway through. They were still all throwing up. They couldn't even get up out of bed to make it to the bathroom at that point, and they started going unconscious. The trip ended in a Bahamas hospital. All had cigatera poisoning. It comes from fish that eat contaminated algae. No matter how well the fish is cooked, you can still be poisoned. They believe it came from these fish speared by Austin off a reef. He was just on oxygen at this point. Christina Martin, Austin's sister, got the phone call. I've never really had anyone in my family go through anything like this, so it was, it was pretty rough. She was told Austin and the others were going through a wide range of symptoms. Austin had it the worst. It's scary thinking that you can eat one piece of fish and wind up in a coma. Austin and his mother were flown from the Bahamas to Miami, where he is still undergoing treatment. He is doing better. Started coming back and his seizure activity started decreasing and he was able to start squeezing my hand. On the phone, Austin's mom told us he has a long way to go. He tires out very easily and he has to have someone watch him 24 hours. She wants others to be warned. If you do eat some fish and you get very, very sick, you need to get somewhere and get treatment. As for Austin, he will be on his way home to continue recovering. I'm just hoping that he makes a full recovery and that he can get back to his normal life. In Manatee County, Kimberly Cuisan, Fox 13 News. Now we checked with Dr. Joe and she says this kind of food poisoning cannot be cooked out of the fish. It can also impact the patient's nervous system, causing cold things to feel hot and hot things to feel cold. And symptoms usually go away in a couple of days, but they can last for weeks.